guys, what is up? It's Emily. Welcome back to my channel. So right now I am in the parking lot of Goodwill, like my new favorite store. I love it so much. Thrifting is, it's fun. But I'm just going to head out into Goodwill and shop around, find some stuff that I can switch up, bring you with me, and then show you how I am making it my own. Okay, let's go rolling into Goodwill. You ready? I should turn off my car first. <laughs> Okay, so the first item is a wrap tank top. As you can see, $2. I'm gonna look more for one like this. I don't know if white is what I'm looking for. But you could totally do this with a cami as well. Just like one of these. Oop, this one's actually perfect because it's a nice flowy material, as you can see. And I really like how it has a V and everything. Okay, let's get started on DIY in this. Okay, the first step is to flip this over because we are working with the back. So you wanna cut this on both sides. Basically, you're cropping the shirt, but you're only doing it on the back layer. So make sure not to cut this all the way through. So once you've removed that layer, flip it over back to the front and cut straight in the middle all the way up through the neckline. And as you can see, now we have a really cute and trendy vest. Totally what we're going for, no, I'm kidding. Put this on and cross it over on each side and then tie it in the back and that's honestly it. So easy. Okay, now for a cutout sort of choker shirt. My hand's so shaky. I found this plain t-shirt. The t-shirts are like $3, a little over $3. So nice and cheap. Okay, so to start this out, I'm taking a highlighter and drawing around the neckline. So this is where I'm drawing the choker sort of deal. And then I'm planning out where I'm gonna make the V. So I put a little dot right in the middle so it would all be even and drew this on. And once you're done with that, it's time for the cutting, so. All I'm doing is cutting everything out. Really complicated, guys. I know. It's so hard. <laughs> okay, the next DIY is using this old pair of leggings. 100% you can get some from the thrift store, but since I'm turning it into a shirt, I thought that might be a little gross, but like, you do you. Not judging at all. So all you have to do is fold these in half and then you're going to cut around the crotch area right here. So I used the handy dandy highlighter again and drew where I'm going to cut. And this time make sure you cut both layers of fabric. Very important. Then here you have a head hole, literally all you have to do. And I love this, pretty sure this one's my favorite. So I'm looking for something with some sort of cool material that I can wear around my neck, you know. Cute. I found this awesome shirt. Look at the beading on this. Okay, so I really like the bottom of this, so I am cutting that off. This is totally a rough cut. Like, this is a really stupid looking choker so far. But once I cut that out, I decided to just cut out the gem things on the bottom, which is cute. Then I am flipping this over and hot gluing some string to both sides so that this way I can tie it around my neck. You can use any old ribbon or honestly any string for this. And I think that this turned out very well. Okay, I also really wanna make a jewelry choker. So I'm looking on tops of the um racks and seeing if there's any old jewelry or anything it's not looking like there is right now but i have some old jewelry at home so i think i'll just use that now that we're home i have this old necklace and i just measured to my neck where a good choker length would be and i use scissors this is pretty cheap so i was able to break it apart easily but you can use wire cutter or whatever for this and honestly, that's it. This has a bunch of loops on it, so I can just attach it wherever. But if you have one that's not like that, you can do the same hot glue and ribbing trick and it will work out great. Okay, so I got these three shirts. Guess how much it cost? Guess. This cost me $9.38 for three like high quality shirts, especially like this with all the detailing in a store. This would be so expensive. I'm really excited. You better be really excited. And I still have a lot of coffee, so good day. All right, that is it for the video. Hopefully you loved it. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Let me know if you, I can't speak English. Let me know if you want to see more clothing hack videos or anything else involving Goodwill, because I love the store. And check out my social media if you have not already. I've been trying to up my Instagram game a little bit, just a little bit. I don't know how it's going, but maybe you like. All right, I'll see all of you in my next video, hopefully. See ya. <laughs> Sometimes I walk a little faster in the school hall. We just